Dallas and welcome back to the Full Stacking channel for another video. <sighs> Can we just take a moment? Let's just take a moment. Breathe in. Breathe in. Breathe out. I want you guys to be present in this moment. I know there is a lot going on in the world. I know that we are almost trapped inside of our homes. I know that people don't always have the best living situation. I understand that people are without jobs and they're struggling to understand what is going on and how they're going to provide for themselves and their families. I understand all of that and I am here with you. I grieve with you. I cry with you. I pray for you and with you. I hear you. But I want us to re maintain present in this moment. This is a safe space. This is a very inspiring, encouraging space. I built it as such. God created me to, to create something as such. So I want you guys to know that I don't come on here and take what's happening outside lightly. I'm not coming over here just to gloss over any things. But I'm not going to sit here in front of this camera and talk about all the bad that's going on in the world. Instead, I am going to talk about the beauty and I'm going to share that with you guys. So I just wanted to take a moment just to clear the atmosphere, to create a space and to, to inspire you and encourage you and lift you up. Know that I am praying with you and for you. I hear your cries and my prayers. I hear your, I see your faces in my dreams. You might like, what, Nadia? That's weird. But I truly am called for the people. I am truly created to be a light for the people. So I hear you. I feel you. I see you. All of that and I am praying with you and for you during this um, un unprecedented time these are strange times whether you spend the day working on something creating building or you spend the day binge watching or you spend the day reading or you spend the day writing whatever you do during this time as, as long as you do as long as it keeps you happy sane uplifted and positive it does not matter. You do not have to come out of this with a whole business, a Fortune 500 company, a whole new endeavor. You could come out of this just saying, I survived. And that is okay. And that is okay. So I want you guys to leave down in the comment section and type, I'm okay. I'm okay. You can share, I'm okay doing this. I'm okay with this. Just let me and everybody else know, all the other stylists know, that you are okay. Okay? So, with that being said, welcome back to the Full Style Ink channel. I am Nadia, the creator of Full Style Ink, and it has been a very long time indeed. I have been working creative, um, creatively and not so creatively. I've been extremely busy. I started making masks, and I've had several large order of masks to come through um, for hospitals and private clinics, and as well as a few of my friends that work in homes for people with disability and... Um, other situations so I have been selling and donating masks to several people around the city of Chicago as well as in Virginia um, Ohio and Atlanta and a few other places so I have been spending my time sewing and giving back and donating I haven't always liked it I'm not gonna lie I did do some complaining but God is working on me with that so the reason why you haven't seen anything since my live is because I have been deep diving in that. But I do have content that I want to create, content I want to finish. So today is going to be a filming day for me. I'm going to get several things done, God, God willing. And the first one is a spring haul. So before all of this, all of this stuff happened, I had planned to do a quite a bit of spring DIY and spring shopping because I was so excited about spring. And it looks like here in Chicago. We're actually going to get a spring, but we're not going to be able to enjoy it because we're in the house. And that makes me so sad. But, however, I did do a quite a bit of shopping at a few stores. And I wanted to share it with you guys. So, instead of sitting behind this camera just showing you, showing you what I have and then later doing a try on, I thought it would be cute and fun and special if I just did a whole straight through try on. So, you know, I've been feeling down. I have my days of feeling down, feeling low, and feeling high, and I haven't done my hair, I haven't done my makeup in weeks. So I decided I want to do more than just a try on haul. I want to play dress up. I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to take these beautiful, fun, 
flowy, colorful, printed items that I got for the spring and how I'm going to incorporate them into my thrifted DIY closet. Showing you guys at least two or three ways on how to wear some of these items because let's be honest, people buy stuff but don't ever wear it and it's mainly because they don't know what they can wear that with. But with me, I never had that problem. But I want to show you guys how I can wear, how I will wear and pair these items. And most of these items are still available. There are new items. I did really well. Um, so you be, I will leave all the links down below so you can check them out and you can pick some of these items up for yourself as well. So with that being said, and we are in a good positive headspace, I am going to head over to a future Nadia trying on these items. Enjoy, stylists. Oh, and I also picked up a few pairs of sneakers. Um, because of the situation with my foot, plantar fasciitis and tendonitis and all that other bad stuff, I am no longer able to wear sandals, slides, um, flat shoes. I have to wear stuff with serious art support in here and heel cushion. So I have to get back into my whole sneaker game. I have let it go in the past few years, eh, more than the past few years, because I couldn't afford to keep up with it. And I wanted to, you know, try to be a girly girl. But the sneaker game is coming back because you can do, you could be a girly girl and still rock a good pair of sneakers. So I have a few pairs I want to try out. I'm going to take my dive back into the sneaker world easy and simple. So I have a few pairs I want to show you guys. So yeah, this is going to be a try on play dress up haul as well as I get to show off my shoes. So first up stylers is this beautiful pleated skirt from Rev Dolls. It is the all you need satin standard skirt. Um, I got this in a size 5X. I could have gone down and it's a little bit loose in the waist. But um, this is what it looks like. I absolutely love this. It is fun. It is flirty. You can definitely dress this up. Dress this down. Casual. Lunch. Going out. Um, sightseeing. dress is still available I got this one in a 4x and it is definitely something that I'm gonna have to save for the fall um, the fabric is very thick and comfy it's like a plush jersey but it's definitely gonna be too warm in the summertime but I love the fit I love the color I love the prints and I love the length as well their satin slip dress um, satin maxi dress absolutely love this color I got this in a 5x and it's a color royal blue they have three other three other colors but I think the black one is sold out it is quite big on me at the top you can see me um, moving around with it but the straps are adjustable so I do fix that later um, I'm glad I did get a 5x and not a 4x the 5x helps fit around my stomach and butt better
first stuff from Eloquy is this gorgeous powder blue tear knitty skirt. I love this. It's so girly and frilly. I thought it was too girly at first when I got it, but it is perfect. I had a wish list to have um, a pleated skirt this spring, and I got two of them, and I absolutely adore this. This is Easter. This is bridal shower, baby shower. This is um, spring luncheon. Oh, so gorgeous. You can dress this up. You can dress this down. This skirt is in the color um, Celeste. Yeah, Celeste Blue. I got it in a size 22-24, and I'm glad I did. Um, a 26, 28 would have been way too big around my waist and probably made it flare out a little bit too much around my hips. So I'm glad I got it in a size 22, 24. Next up from Eloqui is this wrap mini skirt. Eloquy gets my life with these skirts. They are giving me life with these skirts. I love this wrap skirt. It is a true wrap skirt. The waist ties are a little short, but I got this in a size 26. Um, I would have went up to a size 28 just so that the ties could be a bit longer. Again, this is perfect for spring, perfect for summer. It is kind of light and sheer, so you definitely have to wear like some shorts underneath this because it's sheer. <music> Two other skirts I have from Eloquy is 24, and I feel like that is a good fit for this type of skirt from them. Again, dress this up, dress this down, day, night, office, play, gorgeous, gorgeous, all year um, around skirt. Uh, well, for me, because I love color all year round. <laughs> is this bellow sleeve top um this is the same top that i paired with that blue pleated skirt um, and i'm pairing it here again for some different looks i absolutely love this top it's supposed to be off the shoulder but for some reason it doesn't want to stay down on my shoulders but either way i think i i, I absolutely love the crisp whiteness of this top i love the sleeves i love the look that it gives me it definitely is good for multiple vibes <music>
picked up these high-waisted mom jeans in a size 28 and as you can see they did not fit I had so many plans for this for these jeans oh well Thank you.